1898 year, during excavations near the Egyptian city of Saqqara, they found a small winged object that looked like a bird. Archaeologists from the Egyptian Antiquities Service dated the find to the 3rd century BC. The find was transferred to the Egyptian Museum of Cairo, where it lay in storage at number 6347. Indeed, this mysterious object made of sycamore wood and weighing about 40 grams was pointed in the form of a beak in front, an eye was depicted on this side, and on the other side, the second eye may have been erased. The length of the bird is 14 centimeters the wingspan is 18 centimeters. In appearance this figurine is sort of like a bird, but, on the other hand, its tail was a vertical keel which real birds do not have. Half a century later this item was finally put on display in the museum. He did not attract attention for a long time until he caught the eye of Khalil Masika, who was fond of creating model aircraft. Masika considered that the wooden bird is more like a model of an airplane or a glider. But the ancient model does not have a horizontal tail, and without it the plane will be unstable. The doctor admitted that it was simply lost. The lower part of the tail is broken off. Apparently, elevators were attached to it in a horizontal position. Based on this assumption Khalil made a copy of this strange exhibit adding a stabilizer and tested it in flight. She planned well and being equipped with a propeller motor, reached speeds of up to 95 km per hour. Alas the copy made by Khalil has undergone too much alteration to lift it into the air. Martin Gregory another specialist in the construction and piloting of gliders, calculated that the original bird would not fly even with a stabilizer. It has an incorrect balance, and the bending of the wings exacerbates the instability of the flight. Masicha had to make a number of changes in order for the model to fly. In addition he made the model out of a different wood, balsa, rather than the heavier sycamore. And some biologists claim that this device can by no means be any image of a bird, and not only because of the vertical tail, but also in general proportions. and this item does not resemble any of the other known winged creatures. But if the find is not a bird, not an insect and not a glider model, then what is it? Egyptologists have found images of the same birds with vertical tails in the drawings of ancient Egyptian ships. They were at the top of the masts and most likely served as weathercocks. Researchers have confirmed that the bird makes an excellent weather vane, which steadily shows the direction of the wind, without dangling from side to side. Perhaps the bird also had a ritual meaning. Its wings and body are fastened with an iron nail. Iron in ancient Egypt was a rarity and was considered the sacred metal of the gods.